I think I was eight. And, you know, we, one day we went up to North Star with my family and my grandparents and my dogs. And, you know, my mom got a call from the police saying that we've been robbed. She didn't tell us right away. My mom's like, um, Carter, we gotta go. So my mom and dad left. My grandparents are like, okay, your parents had to go deal with something. So you guys are going to stay with us for a little bit. And, you know, I was a little scared because I didn't know what happened. Like, I didn't know what to do because I was worried that my family might have been endangered. Like, our house had got burnt down and we had nowhere to go now. The next day, my parents came back and they're like, we're going to go home, but we have we had a robbery. And, you know, we went home and, and all my mom's jewelry and her money. Well, not all her money because she had her wallet, but, you know... It looks pretty much the same, except when we could see that things were missing, like in my mom's bedroom, mostly. So our door, if you went to our home then, our door, they like used, I don't know what it's called, but they like used this metal stick thing that was curved. Yeah, crowbar, they used a crowbar and they like opened up the door from that. We were glad to see that everybody was safe. Like no one got hurt, but our neighbors, they said they saw a man walk out of our house he was like carrying a black bag and he was all in black i don't think we ever found him